Hey you guys, so I'm about to go home, but I just having a little coffee break. I got a small dark chocolate iced coffee. This is my favorite drink at Coffee Bean. Um, and I haven't had one in a while, so I'm splurging. I used to get the large, but I would never finish it. Like the real big one. Like the equivalent of the Starbucks Trenta. But the only reason I came over here is because I got this. I haven't had this in like, I want to say since 2020 was the last time I bought it. And I might have had one last year, like made some that I had it for my stash, but I don't know where it is by now. It's probably got bad. Or, I know some of them got damaged, the water got on them. So I got another one. You get 18 of these. And I got hooked on these because my friend, we met up. A coffee bean at Dime Bar one time, you know, and we were just talking, and she gave me a gift card for my birthday, um, the next year for coffee bean, and I got this, because I got, I ordered this drink, and I put, like, um, you can get it with lemonade here, but I usually put the crystal light lemonade, um, and it's really good, and their tea bags, they're really good, so, like, you can use them for more than one time like regular two eggs you can too but they kind of get less strong like right away versus these but this is my second coffee because i've got to tell you okay so my friend called me from work yesterday it was funny okay because i i text him i'm all dude this is gonna be a good check coming up because we get paid for memorial day plus we're working 11 this week He's, uh, and then he just starts, he calls me. I thought he was just going to text. He calls me. And he's like, you lying. And I'm like, <laughs> bruh. And then so, like, we were talking for a minute, and he was just telling me the latest that what happened at work while I was gone. And, like, it was funny. It was a good conversation. And it was just nice talking to him because he's been going through some things. And, you know, we haven't had our little powwow in a while. So, it was nice that he called me because... Like, I'm, I'm more of a texter in general, but when, because when people call me, those conversations go on forever. So I was like, I'm all, okay, I'm going to send you a screenshot of it. Because he didn't want to believe it that we get paid today for today. Even though we're not working. Well, but if you work tonight, like the ones that we're going to have, they're getting kind of happy. Right? You're going to get some good check. Let me see my Aldi haul, y'all, real quick. I got these what, sandwich rolls. Because I like to eat my sandwiches on these type of things. Not on regular bread. And they're cheaper at Aldi. Prices have gone up on stuff. Like I noticed in California, like a lot of the eggs now are cage free. So they went up. And I don't know how before all this thing's been going on with everything else. I don't know. Their eggs used to be really cheap, like under a dollar. So now they're like $2.99. I don't know if it's because he's free or what, but that's about what they are, Sprouts and Trader. I don't know about Trader's, but Sprouts, so. I was going to get some, but I don't need any yet, but I'm probably going to end up coming back here because this week, if I got to get more. I don't really eat a lot of eggs, so. but my dad sometimes likes hard boils. Um, but since he's leaving in a week, um, a week from tomorrow, a week from Wednesday, I don't need to really get a lot of eggs because I don't personally eat them. I use them in things, but I don't, so I like to have them, but I don't eat them unless I'm in the mood for it. Um, but I am going to be eating them at home, so I got them, but, you know, so I'm not out eating them. I haven't really been eating out as much as I used to. Um, so now i got to just tackle, like, the spending in stores, but I've got them better, but I have... Like, I was selling the Lyft driver, I've had, like, some problems in terms of, like, certain stores. I just, uh, I give in to, like, impulse things. I'm like, well, it's cheap, it's on sale. Like, I already had hella clearances going on on a lot of stuff. They're trying to move because they always have to move for new stuff. And so, I got a, one or two goodies, but they were, like, $2 and stuff. But still, you know, that's going against what my goals are. So, I got this. Like I said, I didn't have a spatula. Because my other one's too stiff that I got. And this is only a dollar ninety-nine. And I checked it for bendability. <laughs> bendability. 
I got some lemonade for Slay. See, my tea I just got. I got my dad the bootleg Pringles because he wanted some chips. And these were $1.09. The um, Pringles in there were $1.99. So I saved like 90 cents. <laughs> hey. Um, got some lemon pepper. 97 cents. I spent about 20 something in all these, so I just did. But all together, including the apples and the coffee bean, I spent, I think it's 25. Traders is about, I want to say 40. For everything. Um, Aldi was about 20, so 25, so. That's about 90, and then, um, because 25 and 25, the Sally and Aldi's were 50. Yeah, so 90 something, including Trader, Sally, and Aldi, and then Coffee Bean. I spent about, and I walked over to Coffee Bean, so I didn't have to pay lift, so I spent about, um, the tea was about 12. And then the coffee, and so that's good. So I want to see all together. As far as what I bought, I went maybe a hundred, maybe a hundred or five, hundred ten. And then with lift included, just to get home, it'll be three dollars. So nine dollars round trip for everything. So about I want to say under hundred twenty for everything today. So that is a lot, but it's not an everyday thing. And I just stick with my lint, with what I needed at the stores. I stuck to what I needed. So, I got a few things at, Sprout, at Traders I wasn't planning to get. And I got a few things at Aldi I wasn't planning to get. But at Traders, I got maybe a few more things I wasn't planning. So, that's why it was about 30 Plus, I returned that thing. So, that gave me $6 back. So, I ended up spending 40 over there. So, I can do better, but I'm doing a little better. Baby steps. <laughs> Toddler steps. <laughs> I gotta stop this baby something. Okay, I got some spaghetti sauce. Alright. Organic mac and cheese. It was a dollar something. The real one, or the basic one, was like 40 something cents. But I don't usually eat this type. I have to feel like the bake time that you bake, like mama bakes. Had a little bit of recipe. But I ain't making all that for today. Because it's just me and my dad. Man. I got a candle. This is on clearance. Two something. Two nineteen. It smells amazing. Cucumber in it. And it's three wicks, so it's gonna be strong. But they must not fold it, so I'm not good. And um what was I gonna say? Uh, oh present rolls. I saw a recipe that was on my Facebook and TikTok. With air fryer biscuit, ham and biscuits, ham and biscuits. So I'm gonna do that. That's why I got the biscuit dough too. Um, one of these, and then I got a peach of that. Everything's blocking me. Disinfectant wipes. Some canned fruits for my dad. He wants a fruit cocktail. And then I got the biscuits. I got I these flaky Aldi brand. You guys, on Instagram, they were trying to charge, up charge everything. Okay, for Aldi for some reason. Like Walmart and stuff ain't really like that, but I don't know this. But, like, for what the Aldi biscuits, they were trying to upsell it to oh to something, and here it was a dollar something. So uh, maybe it's just because of Aldi. But you should not notice that with the other stores, I like Sprouts and Walmart, and even Square Final, or the other stores I've done Instagram and for, and they didn't. Uh, everything was the price it usually is. So I don't know. Oh, and I got these two dollars. So I'm gonna make those TikTok live, but now that it's already like getting into the day already, I'm gonna start um, 
cookie when I get home. I'm gonna make my hamburgers for us, turkey burgers. And I'm gonna make um, the potato salad. And my dad, I was gonna make stuffed bell peppers. Um, and I would just have to get bell peppers tomorrow or something. But it depends if I'm in the mood to, to eat it or make it yet. I was gonna make them now. So I've been wanting to make them. And since I have the kitchen to myself right now, I just have time to do all this stuff now. So I, I'm trying to make a lot of things I've been wanting to make. But anyway, guys, I'm going. I'm gonna order my lunch and get home. And I hope you guys have a good Memorial Day. Um, and uh, well, I was gonna do something else when I got home. I'm gonna cook, but I was gonna do. I'm gonna taste test, but I don't know. It depends. I got some macaroni and cheese from Sprouts in a box. Um, it's hatched chili macaroni and cheese. I was gonna get that. I mean, I got that there. I was gonna have that for our side today, too. So I don't know. Maybe that and the potato salad, because the potato salad's gonna be a small now. But it's gonna be enough, but I'm gonna make it a lot because. You know, it's just the two of us. Um, but, so, anyway, guys, have a good Memorial Day. And, um, again, thanks for watching my videos. Uh, I really appreciate it. And, um, just, uh, stay up, stay positive, and enjoy your day. Enjoy your loved ones. Um, reach out if you need help to people that care about you, because people do care. Um, just don't, you know, don't keep things bottled up to yourself. And that's, like, what I've been just learning recently. I've been learning over the years, but I just never really put it into practice. But, yeah, I've been just reaching out more. And so, yeah, it's helping me a lot. It's day-to-day -day thing with me. But, so, yeah. Anyway, we'll see. Um, okay, talk to you guys later. Bye.